South Dakota. We have our first hailstorm and our first time in South Dakota. These are some huge pieces of hail, like literally golf ball size. Flooded that way? Yeah. I guess survey the damage on the trucks. What do you think? Yeah. I think we got lucky. I think only those really big pieces were kind of sporadic. Yeah. I can't so we just had a hell storm, as you saw by our news reporter. So we are. Daddy, put me on the uh, tile. Yeah, put on the tile. Yeah. We'll get up on the camp roof later, check the solar panels, but I think we're okay. But it was a little excitement for the afternoon. It's easier on the ears. That one might be a little bleak. I wasn't sure which way. Hey, Winnie, stay over there, buddy. He's always been like 99%. <laughs> So we're at our pit stop halfway. What are the what's the verdict so far? Um, it's um very speedy. Very speedy. Listen, what do you think of the ride so far? Um, why did you see a trail behind Mama? Mm, okay. Um, Mama didn't even look at it. It's just right there. I don't know. Did y'all see any buffalo yet? No. No buffalo. Well, we should see some coming up here. We're on the what's it called? Oh. Wildlife Loop. The wildlife loop. So on this wildlife loop. I'm just praying that we can see some buffalo with wings so then we can have buffalo wings for lunch. Buffalo wings. Well, right now, goldfish is the lunch. Right? All right, we'll get a five-minute break and then everybody back to the short bus, okay? Mm -mm. It's going down. All right, so it's our last full day at this KOA near Mount Rushmore. We had the exciting storm last night with the, the hail. I don't see a lot of damage or anything. There may be like one little ding on the truck, but nothing major. So we're going to go to Mount Rushmore again. It's the last time we did it, um, we did the actual, the nighttime ceremony, the real patriotic ceremony. Uh, I think everybody kind of enjoyed that. It's something that's good to do. Uh, we watched it be lit up at night. So we're going to go see it during the daytime. Just walk around it, kind of explore a little bit for the next hour or two. You don't need a lot of time there. Uh, you can kind of get it mostly done pretty quickly. So we're going to go enjoy this last day of nice weather. And then we'll check out of here tomorrow. And we're kind of just working our way, continuing west towards Yellowstone. But right now, we're going to go back and check out Mount Rushmore. This visitor center is located below this tent. Right 
What was the question I'm asking? Yeah, the recording ended in 1935. So we left Rushmore today and we are now in Montana. About a, probably about a five hour drive. We're right before Billings somewhere. Uh, we are going to travel a little bit tomorrow, but we're checked in here and set up. We've got the Starlink out and working, and then we're just kind of settling in for the day. We're gonna have we got two travel days, and then we're gonna be in the West Yellowstone. Uh, we'll be back in a KOA there, and we don't really have our plans for tomorrow yet. So we'll check back in when we are checking into Yellowstone, unless something exciting happens again on the road.